If you're coming in from a career point of view for trading and automated trading, going into the line of hedge funds and high frequency trading, uh, I've said this in the past, I think if you put Rhythmic and the API on your resume, I also think if you can showcase a profitable strategy using Rhythmic, uh, behind the scenes, I think you'll be put at the front of the line. Uh, and I say that because so many institutions use, use Rhythmic um, because uh, they're the easiest and quick, well, not quickest, but easiest path to high frequency trading. And then when I say high frequency trading, I'm talking about true high frequency trading where you can get access right into the CME Aurora data center or any of the other major SGX, Urex, ICE. Um, that's the advantage with uh, Rhythmic. I, I'm not going to sit here and say I love Rhythmic, but outside of the banks and the big fees they charge, um, this is the next best path for retail folks to get in. Um, it's not the most it's the most accessible, but it's not the friendliest. If you get support at all, uh, you're better off to go through an introductory broker, in, introducing broker with a with a futures account uh, with Rhythmic. And Rhythmic only focuses on uh, futures and options. And you, and the other thing, as I said before, you can do the execution for orders, which you can't do with the data providers like the IQ fees and the data bentos. And they're very expensive. They're way more expensive than what you get for. So with IQ feed, you could pay $140 for the feed. Then you have to pay, I think, a three four hundred dollar uh, API fee with IQ feed, whereas you just pay hundred hundred plus the forty dollars per month, and you're ready to go. And uh, you could start as low as fifteen hundred dollars and practice the futures market, which I'm at now.